Hey guys, Carlo here. It is day 5 or day 6 of the Luzon lockdown and I'm actually going to the home gym today and I want to take this opportunity to review a sneaker. Uh, this is the Adidas SL20. So apparently it is one of those affordable, super lightweight running shoes that you can also use for, well, general workouts. Now, the great thing about this one is that the midsole uses the, I think it's like light strike technology or something like that, which is the same midsole that's used by James Harden for the James Harden Volume 4 basketball shoe. So if you're interested in that, it's just a sneaker that sells for like 5,800 pesos. This is the vlog for you. Let's go. Now, this is actually the sneaker bodega room. So <laughs> these are sneakers that I've either already reviewed or scheduled for reviewing or sneakers that I will eventually sell. Uh, wow, I see an off-white sneaker here. Uh, so this... Oh yeah, so this one I'm going to put in the steel cabinet once it reopens. So it's a brand new uh, off-white Vapor Max. So this is the second generation one, came out together with the white version. And this one is size 9. So if you are size 9 and if you're looking for an off-white Vapor Max in black, brand new, when the steel cabinet reopens, this is your chance. So here it is. This is the sneaker. Uh, I did an unboxing of this already, but uh, so I won't do it all over again. But this is what the shoe looks like. So you have some sort of like mesh upper, which is supposed to be extremely breathable and lightweight. And this is what I was talking about, the Light Strike midsole, which is the same technology used in the James Harden Volume 4 basketball shoe. So yeah, we'll put this on feet, take it to the home gym, and I'll get back to you guys with my review. So while I'm putting on the sneakers, which are still in the box, kamustahan muna tayo. So kamusta na kayo guys? Uh, comment down below how you've been handling the the COVID-19 coronavirus lockdown. So uh, to those who don't know, who don't live in the Philippines, we are on lockdown. We're not supposed to go out of the house. So we've been in the house for the last few days, maybe almost a week now. Uh, and yeah, ako, I've been trying to make the most out of it. I've been trying to work on my fitness. So I've been going to the home gym every day, mix of cardio and HIIT training. Uh, I've been spending more time with my wife as much as possible. Ang sarap mag-reconnect, no? Uh, and you get to know your spouse more. Uh, we've, uh, I've been reading a lot more on stuff outside of politics to, to enhance my knowledge. And I've been working on finishing like my book, which I've been putting off for the longest time now. And of course, our video. So anyway, so before we get to the workout, ang ating socks of the day. So this is actually one of my favorite socks. So it's like a Stan's collab. So Stan's is a brand of socks. So it's a collab with uh, Star Wars. So this one is Darth Vader. <sighs> And that was my bad attempt of making his voice. So, <laughs> so yeah, nakita niyo si John, si Darth Vader, si Darth Vader with the red lightsaber. So, yan. O nga pala, reminder lang kung okay kayo, which basically means nasa bahay lang kayo, you're just chilling, you're just relaxing, uh, and you're okay, you have food, you're actually called to bless others. So, wag lang tayo isip ng sarili natin, no? So, ang daming tao ngayon, a lot of people don't have, you know, food to eat. A lot of people are actually having problems. So if you can donate, uh, please be a blessing to others. This is the time to do so. Kung medyo okay kayo, kung sobra-sobra kayo, kung in excess kayo, now is the time. Uh, what you can do is you can go on Lazada. So the Lazada app now has the Lazada for Good page. So maraming mga NGO doon, charity that you can actually donate to. So there's UNICEF, there's Red Cross. So regardless if you want to donate to frontliners, uh, underprivileged families, uh, displaced workers, and dun sila lahat, no? So, madali lang mag, mag donate. So, if you guys can, please be part of, you know, the, the, be, be a blessing. Help out, okay? So, check nyo lang, check nyo na lang Lazada app or website. Lagang hindi ko pa nasoso to, tinan yun, yung pay tag. So, <laughs> so, alisin natin yung tag. So, yun. Wait lang, ha? may napansin ako, gusto ko lang i-share sa inyo. So, ito yung insole niya. Ang angas! Grabe! Ang angas no insole guys. So, ngayon ko lang talaga siya na-realize how nice it looks. So, kita niyo yun. So, there's some sort of like warrior priestess dito sa baba. So, try natin mag-focus, no? Yan, warrior priestess with the gold markings, you know? Tapos, there's some sort of like... Uh, I don't know what this is. Parang, ewan ko, kung sino siya ba? Ewan ko ba, anime ba yan? Basta parang galit na galit siya. So, siguro magkalaban sila. So, yun yung nasa insole nung, nung Light Strike 20. 
So I'm wearing the sneakers now, no? So I have my Darth Vader workout socks. Uh, this is the Adidas Light Strike 20. And tama sila, sobrang gaan niya, guys. It's really light. It's so super lightweight shoe. Uh, I feel the cushioning. It's actually very good. Uh, very breathable. And yeah, so let's take it to the gym. You've been hearing me talk about the home gym for a while now. Uh, gagawa na lang ako ng separate na tour vlog. And then ikukwento ko sa inyo lahat na laman. Pero to siya. So rubber mats. A couple of machines, a couple of weights, and we're in time Marshall na uh, speakers dyan sa baba. So yeah, we'll go on the treadmill, do a quick, I don't know, 15 minute run, and just do a bunch of stuff here in the gym for general fitness. Let's go! Okay guys, so we just finished like a quick... Babe, go ahead. Yeah! So we just finished a quick 15 minute run. So I'll let, let the wife do her uh, bar three first. And then I'll share with you guys my observations about the shoe. Uh, when it comes to running. And then we'll talk about... Then I'll go back. I'll do like the CrossFit thing. And then I'll get back to you guys again on how it feels. So let's talk about how it felt uh, running in the Adidas SL20. So, pumuna tayo. So, here are the observations. Now, in a sentence, yung Adidas SL20 is the sneaker that you buy if you want a running shoe that you will abuse and beat up. Kung baga, kung may daily beaters ka for your casual wear and your lifestyle, the Adidas SL20 is your beater running shoe. So, in short, if you bought an Ultra Boost and it is pricey AF and you want to use it as a mix of both lifestyle and going to the gym, aka pang pa if you're hitting on somebody in the gym with the shoes, blah, if that will work, uh, then go for your Ultra Boost. But if it's just like a normal run day and you wanna beat a pair of good running shoes up that won't break the back, these are really good shoes. So why do I say they're good shoes? Number one, uh, the cushioning, cushioning or cushioning, however you wanna pronounce it, uh, feels like an alpha bounce. So, and it's not bad. The Alpha Bounce technology is not bad at all. Uh, but it's a little bit more, how do I say this? It's not as mushy, so you feel the support more all around your foot as opposed to uh, the Alpha Bounce. I also prefer this for running versus the Pure Boost and the Pure Boost HD for some reason. I'm just really loving these shoes. Um, and mainly because siguro ito rason, uh, it is so lightweight. Ang gaan niya sa paa. So if you just want to run uh, casually, it works. I, I'll try to look for a hardcore performance review of an actual runner and then I'll link it down below. But cushioning wise, the sport, two thumbs up. And also, I felt that the traction, uh, yung, yung kapit niya, yung grip niya, sobrang panalo din. So even on the treadmill, for example, the, one of the shoes that I was reviewing recently, uh, yung uh, Dual Run from Nike, that one medyo madulus minsan yung ilalim. Eh. So the traction is not as, hindi siya makapit as much. This one, kapit na kapit, as in ramdam mong gumaganon siya. So that one I really loved as well. So all around, if you take into consideration the cushioning, the support, breathability, how lightweight it is, the traction, and the price point. This one sells for less than 6,000 pesos, less than 120 US dollars, and eventually this will go on sale, 100% sure, kasi it's not like hype. Uh, para sa akin, sobrang panalo siya. If, if you can wait it out a little bit, and this goes on like 30, 40, maybe even 50% off in the next few months, I think it's a great steal. If you're looking for a daily beater running shoe, a shoe that you will just abuse and wear out, yung talagang paparusahan ninyo, uh, this is the one to go for. So, so that's like the initial running review. Now we'll go through the, I don't know, the, the, the hit training thing. So, ano ba gagawin natin? So, we're going to do a couple of my usual routine, which is basically uh, 20 squats, 10 push ups. Hindi ganun ka exage na. It's just a beginner workout I saw on men's health. So, ano yun? Uh, 20 squats, 10 push ups, uh, 10 lunges per side. And then there was a uh, plank somewhere there as well as uh, dumbbell rows and yung paborito kong weight resistance band. So we'll do that and then I'll get back to you guys again and then we'll close the vlog off. Hey, so we just finished our workout. So observations. <sighs> so the Adidas SL20 is really a running shoe. I think obviously naman sa pangalan it's a running shoe. 
Uh, what do you mean by that? Because if you do like your typical weight training, the the mid part of the sneaker, of the midsole, all the way to the heel is a little bit thicker, uh, with more of the strike light cushioning. Uh, there's a tendency that it sinks. So pag nags squat ka, or every time you put your weight on either the middle part of your foot or your heel, there's a tendency na medyo mag wobble, hindi siya as balanced. So yun lang yung issue. So again, balik tayo sa main conclusion. If you are looking for primarily a running sneaker that you will beat up, that you will abuse, that will not cost you an arm and a leg, that siguro casually you wanna do, uh, you know, weight training and circuit training and stuff like that, it still works. It's not the best, but it still works. Uh, then you might want to give it a try. So again, sells for 5,800 pesos, not that expensive. Uh, if you want an alternative, something that almost gives like a similar vibe, but it's a little bit more inferior in my head, you might want to check out the Adidas uh, Duramo. So the Duramo sells for 2,900. It uses the cloud foam technology of Adidas. What's the difference between cloud foam and strike light? See, cloud foam is much more mushy. So it's much more soft. See, Strike Light, well, it's primarily made for basketball. It's more denser. So, mas maganda yung support niya. So, between the two, if I were to pick, I'd obviously go with this one, especially if you can get it on sale. And with that said, I hope you guys enjoyed our vlog for today. Uh, as usual, for our power up words of wisdom for the day, uh, if you guys can give, please do give. Check out the Lazada for Good page on the Lazada app as well as the Lazada website. Uh, check out the PayMaya app. There are also options there for you to be able to give back. You can also check out the MVP Rewards app. Uh, not only do you get points for paying your bills in advance, like your PLDT or Smart Bill, uh, but you also uh, get points, rewards points, that you can also use right now to be able to donate. In short, uh, digital has empowered every single person with a smartphone and an internet connection to help. Wala nang palusot. Kung yun dati, kailangan mo pa maghanap ng bibigyan, kailangan pa pumuntang banko para mag-deposit. Now, it's as easy as opening an app, tapping something, and clicking send. And then you bless somebody and you help. Peace, God bless, what's up, boom.